Hello and welcome back to Let's Play. Oh, God, back. <laughs> yeah, welcome back to Mystery Dungeon. Uh, I have not played in a long time, with the exception of the last episode. We're doing these more often. I'm gonna try and get like one per recording session. We're not gonna get these as much as my other Let's Play, cause that's just oh no, <laughs> no, we're taking shade. Hey, the last dungeon was rough for several reasons, but, like, that not having shade was definitely among them. Take the friend bow back, buddy. You're back on the team. Lightning field. Probably not great for the Yobo, but is Well, I'm... Great for this. I should probably turn back down the speed because this is actually like kind of hard to control. All speed. Probably why I had it on regular to begin with. Now that I think about it, it's been a hot minute since the last mystery dungeon episode. That wasn't the buried relic episode. Episode episode. For a second, I thought that was shiny, but no, I, I can't. Pretty sure that couldn't have been, because that wasn't the strong foe. Yeah, I want to bring this back, so we're doing more of this. More often. I'm going to try and just do that with all my Let's Plays. You know, get one episode of every each series in whenever I record. Like, we're gonna have some series more than others and some times where I just can't make an episode for a given series. Mystery Dungeon being the big obvious one since well I'm not gonna lie. Even, like, even when I'm just gunning for the stairs trying to find them too. But yeah, I'm not gonna lie and say it's a quick process. It's to do one dungeon. That isn't 99 floors. And then I have three of them I have to actually complete. I got to get out of the last one because... Well, dumb mistakes and not even completed to get the reward from, from it. Uh, I can do that for the other ones. We have to complete all of the other ones. And one of them has a boss fight. Two of them have a boss fight. One has a restriction. And the other... Other is the hardest dungeon in the game. So it might as well have a boss fight. That's the only way it could be harder. I'd just like to give a quick reminder that sell any items you have, because it's been a hot minute since we've done Mystery Dungeon episodes. Like, gosh, I have neglected this series a lot. I'm trying to bring it back, though. So. Uh, if you want to get caught up, well, there's five episodes that were not recorded with that were before I got my capture card. That's how long this series has been going. That's another thing. I'm not leaving the series unfinished, and I'm like, I'm not starting a new series until I finish this or my other series, which is fine. Drum done. I'm actually kind of curious if we'll see triple digits in that other series. <laughs> or this one, even. Probably not. For this one, at least. That, that's a thing I keep wondering. What's going to be the first series we end up with triple digit? It's just in the episode numbers. Like, what will be the first series I make that has a hundred episodes? That's something I can, like, surprisingly thinking about a lot. Like, uh, more than I probably should. <laughs> but that part just 
popped up in my head. Like a shocking amount. I don't know the time. <laughs> and I like <laughs> there's something that uh oh I still have a combo to make my speed even higher. And I don't care about it. well actually that probably could have been useful if this is the electric dungeon. Oh well. I have the ability to get rid of as long as I can make a move, I can get rid of any status effect, so with refresh so we're fine. Okay, I gotta say, so I've seen a video about Miss Dungeon that I basically had some good ideas if we ever got a new one. Oh but like I was and it got me thinking what I want the most if we get a Mystery Dungeon 5. Which sadly doesn't look likely, but I'm going to continue holding hope it, until it either gets confirmed that it will never happen, or happen, or I die. <laughs> you know, whichever happens first. And I think the thing I want the most is, well, making the dungeon crawling more interesting. You can't exactly get rid of it, because that just kind of gets rid of the name sake of the game series. So that's not really an option. It, and that's another reason, because open world would not work, and changing the battle system to a traditional one of an RPG is just a stupid idea because that's just making it you made you just made a geo card launch with pokemon gameplay that's literally what what a mystery dungeon game with conditional pokemon mis like conditional pokemon gameplay is like that's exactly what that is like don't because like Random recruitment. It's basically what is, and that doesn't seem like a good idea to me. Or, like, I mean, it wouldn't be the worst idea to come from Nintendo, but that doesn't mean it would be a good one. Actually, that would be helpful. And I actually probably should like grab the big apple and this, just in case. But yeah, that's just the kind of thing I think I think about, thought about, like what I want most, and I want what I think I would work. What I believe would work best for a new Mystery Dungeon to freshen up the formula without screwing with it, which is very important. And why open world, which, granted, I I like open world games. Tears of the Kingdom's my favorite Zelda. I don't think it fits every game series. It is, and personally, I even believe Pokemon. I I haven't actually played Sky and Violet, so my opinion is greatly subject to change but without having actually the played past getting Maridon of Pokemon Violet I honestly prefer the idea of just the segmented open world it might be an unpopular opinion but it's my opinion Well, P Pikachu is here. That's a pretty good Pokemon if you didn't pick it as a status. How did it pick up here? Also, the like, also Jolteon can be found here, just like you can find Flareon in. There you go with Raikou. Oh, 
Oh dear. Yeah. The Ovo isn't as fast as the Flash. You idiot. There is an easy solution, yo, bro. Wow, you just... <laughs> Character-wise, they, like, matched very well to the Yobo act, how he actually is, in my opinion. Gameplay-wise, they're just flipping idiot. Idiot, and, like... Yeah, the Yobo ain't. In it is like the like the of the actual person behind the tent. Also, oh my God, do Blizzard just take them all out in the one foul swoop? It's so easy. Thank you. I'm amazed they live. Sure. I mean, I already have a Pikachu, but like, Pikachu's good, so I'll take another. I'll take another Pikachu. Oh, this thing. That's going in. I am just the F. I'm the tank. I'm the glass. I'm the glass cannon physical attacker. I'm everything. Seriously, the only way Leaf Gun could really- well, actually, no, they could have a better type. But, like, the only- I- Leaf Gun is surprisingly good in this. Why the heck is it a tank in the main games? I feel like it really should have been swap of Flareon, because, like, Flareon has high attack, despite the fact that with Neck Bloof and- well, this Bloof that Flareon has. Like, it would- seems like it would be better as a very defense-focused Pokémon. And then, it feels like Grass type It really feels like it should have been. Like, like, not the defensive one with their five weaknesses, I'm pretty sure. Why is that generally the worst? <laughs> Why did my two favorites have to be the two worst evolutions? Yeah, uh... I never actually finished my thought when I was talking about... my... what I would want for a fifth mystery dungeon, personally. I believe that... Battle should not be changed. And honestly, what I think it could be done is take something out of the book of, uh, if I can remember the top of my head. Believe it or not, what I think the, like, best idea is for Mimis Dungeons, weird cutoff, I, I really hope my mic is not going down the drain. is taking it from something from Gates of Divinity from all things as well, is don't have the grid based moving when just exploring dungeons. But, but just in battle. And do something like in some, there's some parts of Gates of Infinity where you get to move around freely and if you interact with a wild Pokemon, then the map gets a grid and you fight with the grid system that has worked so long. I think just doing that for battle and not the dungeon crawling 
would definitely would like kind of be the best of both worlds. Also, really would speed up, up or at the very least feel faster than uh, dungeon crawling. Crawling does now, because I'm not gonna lie, I love Mystery Dungeon and the dungeon crawling. I have my limits though. And these get pretty long, like, game. game. And overall, I'll admit, they do kind of feel slow. Like, what people say, like, pe people who don't know how to play Xenoblade 2, who feel Xenoblade 2's combat is, is when, really, it's really fast-paced, just the game has had horrible tutorials. But, like, actually, and not as bad. That was the world's worst explanation of this game feeling slow. Oh, at times. Like, I'm not saying by any means it's slow all of the time. I mean, but there is moments where it does honestly feel pretty slow. I'll be honest. And I think that would really help with that. Okay! I probably should have saved that, but you know what? Flip it. Flip it, I feel like seeing some stupidly high damage number. As I said, stupidly high damage numbers. Also, I need to stay the flip away so I don't get... Uh... Paralyzed and lose my, uh... Awakening. Yeah, that's just what I've kind of been thinking about a little recently. I definitely want a new mystery dungeon, though. I don't know if they'll live something other than a false break. Yep, they're dying. Well, at least we got to see some big numbers. Numbers like I wanted. I should have used it on save aid. Seen another meta, meta, mega evolution. Even resisted. Wait, no, that's not resisted. I was gonna say even resisted hits are doing that much, but no, it, it's not resisted. I'm just wrong. Think flip those tiles do not remove awakening and neither does refresh. <laughs> but yeah, I <laughs> I love Mr. Dungeon regardless, but like I do wish they would kinda like do that. Or at the very least, do that more than they like, actually did engage, if they... if nothing else. Because, like, it would be nice to have, like, some... like, a few preset... paths to this game. Sure. I am back. Alright, we still have Squeeze Out on you.
Well, luckily that doesn't count as a status effect in Roberto Lee. Yeah, having two people who use Blizzard is very effective. Not what I meant to do, but oh well. Oh no, they're gonna kill it. Yeah, this is kind of why I said unless you want to be one of the original evolutions, not to do it, because you can very easily get. Oh, okay, good. You can very easily get the Kanto evolutions this way. Oh my god, they live. But they didn't want to join up. I guess I'll get rid of this, because we can't use it, and I'm never going to actually bring it to a mystery dungeon with me. That. We do so much damage with Awakening. I mean, yeah, it doesn't probably matter. Okay, for a second I thought that was the best effect. Yeah, we're definitely stronger than, uh... Shade. That's more defense. Very ironic, given that grass type, but, like, I am just an iron wall. Any more items I literally can't use? Yeah, heal ribbon. Ribbon that I already have three of, so never need any more of them. This is gonna hit everyone. Well, I didn't really want another cast turn anyway. Didn't mean to do that, but okay. Yeah, as I said, you can kind of snap the steed dungeons going wrong. And being honest, I do like the challenge, but... Well, I'm gonna be honest. I don't find the final dungeon of this mystery dungeon to be all that memorable. I'm pretty sure I said that a lot in that. I don't know. It's been a very, very long time since I actually made the episode of where I did my, like, plot repairs in the final boss battle. And did the rematch for that matter. That's well worth Switching something out. Yeah. But I just wanted to mention that because I. <laughs> this is the only one, too. I don't know why. 
Ooh, mine them. <laughs> Who can deal with explosions and I don't have? I also want to say, I really like the rare quality we have. Because it affects the whole party, so it's fine that it both, both attack and- Oh god. I going to say, it's fine that it buffs both attack and defense and... Well, oh, not attack and defense, attack and special attack. Since it affects the whole party. Whenever anyone gets hit. So, it's multi-use. Used across the board. I also learned that this uh, bandana only adds 10 to my attack. Last episode. So, like... Not sure how good it actually is. Uh, we'll see. Being honest, I honestly prefer the Mystery Dungeon games to main series. Why did they do that instead of using a tiny apple? I thought it would still be alive, and I was mashing the button. Well. Oh, hi! Yo, bro, you... Oh my god! What are you doing? Use Blizzard and take them all out in a single hit! Pop your off afterwards. But you, you've never given a flip about not using up all of your PP. Why do you suddenly give a flip? Don't. Well, that's not a hard decision. Goodbye, one that doesn't have a special skill. I'm just gonna... Goodbye. I miss you. Wait, what? I didn't mean to play this game. Yep, taking that. Couple plans not the best. What's that part of my item? Nothing worth my time. Well, that kind of sucks. I didn't mean to get rid of my massive attack boost. Also, I don't know why my audio... Like, I don't know if it is actually, like, glitching. I've noticed it a little bit. Like, some words just, like, get dead twice. And my controller dies while I'm playing. But the gameplay doesn't get interrupted for some dumb reason. Despite the fact that's how it is in every single other game I play. It's a really good thing these are like not Oh what? What the heck? It's in the dark. I got actually got pushed up by the joy kind uh, not the joy kind. Yeah. 
Jeez. And I'm back. Yeah, just, just like that. Like, oh, come on. Be back in a moment. With that pick, let's keep going. Well, we're about halfway up the dungeon. I think I am just going to see you with something worth note happening. Happen? We're at the top. I do. Okay. Good to know. I guess I'm gonna give it a Pikachu because I already have a Pikachu. I don't have a Raichu. Well, I guess something interesting did end up happening. After all, I walked right into that one. Literally. Well, guess I see you at the top, probably. Oh, come on! I was so close to the end, too. Oh, well, there goes my awakening. Why do you have to use that against the boss? No. I think I better take my chances against the Mega Evolution. <laughs> How long is this paralysis? How long does this paralysis blah, 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 blah. paralysis last? Oh, you have so much less health than us. Oh my god. Please just let me use my move so I can have that happen. Sure. Here we are. Why? Why have you come? This is the lightning field. This is my domain. I am Raikou. One who races with lightning. My body is like rolling rain. <laughs> I can't English. Apparently. My roar echo that echoes thunder. Many have trespassed upon my mode me. I can't eat. That's not even the mic glitching. That's just me. Well, that was. That's just me being an idiot. I'm getting some water. Ah. But what became of them? Let me demonstrate. You two shall experience the pain and they suffer. Well, we're not gonna destroy them as bad as I wanted to. But they ain't gonna be... Uh, well... After the Oh my god! Okay. Oh god. That just buffed all of us. I knew it was a good idea to take this. Can't get sat lowered. Not what I thought that did. Sorry, did they just triple discharge? Or was that two different people? I didn't notice. Can I get multiple? Nope. I mean, we're hitting with the fully charged, but we hit normally with the awake. So we're probably gonna. We're definitely fine. And at this point, it's just how long does he last before he drops? Up to the crazy power we gained from going in the buried relic. Like, we're dishing out hundreds of damage in a single attack. Well, they're not. They're dishing out about 50, but we got them. 
Oh, how dare you? How? How did this happen? I'm pretty sure this is a voice I gave Ente, actually. Regardless, you have won. Let me hear your wit. Feather. Hmm, <laughs> this. This is the Red Wing. You. Stand back. I'm gonna electrocute it. It's been so long since we've done this. I would not blame you if you had forgot. I probably should have mentioned it sooner, but we're trying to, like, go to the free beast. Like, legendary beast to power this up to meet the Mirage Pokemon. You probably know what it is. Reckless from the pot electrocuted the Red Wing. The Red Wing transformed into the Sunset Wing. It's a subtle more graduation of yellow to red, or gradation of yellow to red. It is a true beauty, beauty of sight. Go northeast to a place called the North Wind Field. That summer will kind of be even better than you. <laughs> like, and they was an even match. This one was probably the hardest in theory because we had a type disadvantage but not an advantage. The next one we have an advantage and a draw instead of a draw and a disadvantage. So we're gonna have even an easier time in there. You'll find a Pokemon named Suiku. If you're lucky enough to meet Suiku, perhaps your wish could come to welcome true. Well flipped. <laughs> Right. <laughs> when the game doesn't have voice acting, you have to deal with my poorly done voice acting. But I ain't leaving the zero voice acting next morning. We have uh, another subplot that's been going on that's kind of important. One that's been going on this whole time. I realize I don't know if we're going to spot we might want to ditch one of our things because we actually have a like proper request now that I think about it we gotta grab. Wow, I really just left some of these. And then if we look around... Oh, we now have three in the... Oh, God. Julie, is that our purity force? That's actually important for us to take. Uh, I'd high recommendation for that dungeon. Get as many jobs there as you can. We'll be going there, there eventually. Joyce Tower was not a dungeon that's particularly worth going to, though. Do we have any more for Purity Forest? No, we don't. Okay. Well, now for the actual story. One. Kev Reed. Kev. Oh, Kev Red. <laughs> the SOS mail apparently sent by Metatomb. My name is Metatomb. I had no trouble entering this dungeon. It was horrible here. It's much too much effort. It's much too difficult. Ekans, he was defeated right away. It makes me want to scream. Somebody, please help me. This place is Wish Cave. I know there's an item in there you have to get for the Pokemon in there. And it's the third hardest dungeon in the game. And the second hardest you actually have to do if you want to get all the title screen pictures. Oh, there's a secret. But it's a really nice. You can be sure of that. Yeah, you just kind of get an item you need for the Pokemon in as the reward. That said, I don't think we have any other stories that we can go and accept. We have Lugia, we have which 
God, no. I ain't going down a 99 floor dungeon. We have Wish Cave, which this, in your first, you have to go to Wish Cave twice. Once to rescue Megatam, once for the actual, like, goal. And as you can see, yeah. We had to go down to floor 20 for Metatam with the restriction of starting at level 5. This is an effect that only 3 dungeons have. That being the other two being Troy's Tower, which you also can't bring items. And if I can find it. Purity Forest, which is the hardest dungeon in the game. Aim and only let you bring one Pokemon, no items, start at level 5, use Charizard. We theoretically, theoretically, we could do this. Realistically, heck no. Oh, I'm not doing that. And... I don't want to do the first visit to Wish Cave yet, so next time on Pokemon Miss Dungeon, we're going to the North Wind Field. See y'all then. Bye bye.